welcome back to another episode of Cascadia Kayak Angler. Today we're chasing Cascadia's only native crayfish, the signal crayfish. We've come to Timothy Lake, high in the mountains of northern Oregon, to go after these delicious crustaceans. Oregon allows anglers to take up to 100 crayfish per angler, and you don't even need a fishing license in order to do this. So it's a great opportunity to come down here, enjoy some kayak fishing on a really beautiful mountain lake, and go after these delicious crayfish or freshwater lobster. So today we're just using the small crayfish pots you can see there in Sidra's hands. Those pots are quite affordable to pick up at any sporting goods store, for usually for under $10, and even less during sales. And those will work satisfactory to the top of those we're just attaching a buoy you can use a milk jug or whatever you like just so you can mark your pot location and we're filling those with uh, old salmon bellies some old strips of tuna and other parts of rotten fish including some uh, shad I caught this year you can also use fresh shad uh, cat food canned tuna with holes punched in the top or even uh, cooked corn that's been corn on the cob that's been smashed up makes apparently very good bait for these crayfish. So we're gonna start dropping our pots here and uh, we'll come back later, check on them this evening and refresh the bait and let them soak overnight and see what we got in the morning. All right, so when I'm dropping these pots, um, the one thing I wanna do is, uh, if I have any extra slack line, I wanna take that up and tie it up in a knot near the buoy so that I don't have a long uh, payout of string and rope that uh, prop can get tangled in for the powerboat fishermen out here. I'm going to go ahead and drop this over the side. First six hours soaked with pots. Got some nice sized crayfish there. See what they call them signal crayfish? They have that bright red color under their pinchers. Here we got oh, a little more than a dozen six hour soak so hopefully we'll get twice as much as that if not more overnight which will give us probably around uh, 30 to 50 crayfish but uh, yeah those look great good start all right so we let the pot soak overnight and we're headed out to check them now winds already kicking up quite a bit so be happy to get them out of the water before I start getting white caps again. It's a little chilly out here on the water this morning. I have Sidra pulling the pots for me while I control the boat. Working as a team. Most of the developed campgrounds are found on the south shore of Timothy Lake. You'll need to acquire a day use pass or use your camping pass in order to launch from the facilities there. We found most of our crayfish 25 to 75 yards offshore. We found that pots on level ground tended to catch more crayfish than those that were on steeper terrain. As always, when kayak fishing, be sure to wear your PFD and have a great and safe time out on the water. <laughs> 